Hey guys, I'm really excited to show you the new feature called Automatic Gift that allows you to give free products uh, in the cart just before checkout to boost your sales and to increase your conversion rates. So you need to first go to Advanced Discount Rules because this feature is part of the Advanced Discount Rules and not the Basic Rules. And you can check the tutorial but you can also click on new rule and start to create the free gift. So you click on the radio button right there, give a product free or discounted, and then you, of course, search for a product inside your store. Let's say I want to give this product for free. I could also give it half price or a custom amount. But I mean, for the purpose of this demo, I'll give it for free. Uh, this is the title that will be displayed inside a modal window, a pop-up uh, for your customers. So we have a gift for you or, you, you, you know, you can edit it and you can also add a subtitle or, for example, you could say that the customer will save I mean, a, a value of 30 bucks. I don't know how much is this product, but you can write something here and then you can actually you have to set a rule or multiple rules that will trigger or fire this free gift pop-up so i'm gonna make a simple rule but you know as you can see here you can make pretty complex stuff but i'm gonna make a simple rule that if the amount inside the cart is over a hundred dollars then i'm gonna apply uh i'm gonna give a product for free I could also restrict it for specific products. So for example, I could say if we have at least a hundred dollar worth of this product or if this product is in the cart at least, then show um, the, the free gift pop-up. But I'll keep it simple for the matter of the demo. Then here I'll name it free gift over hundred dollars. I'll create a new group. Groups are um, they 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 are useful to, for example, if you would have multiple tier of free free gift. For example, uh, product X is given for free if the card is over a hundred dollars, and product Y is given for free if the card is over five hundred dollars. Then you could group them inside one single group, and you could have tiers of free gift. And I will publish it. The reason why the status is draft by default is, well, because we don't want you to give products for free as you edit uh, the rule and as you create your free gift uh, discount. So I'm going to save it. Here I can see it's published. I could unpublish it. And I could publish it. Then I'll wait 5, 10, 15 minutes maybe, depending on cash and, you know, server stuff. And it will propagate in your store. As long as I have a product over $100 in the cart, I will see a pop-up like this. And what is pretty cool is that I could choose the size, so 10 years, 12 years, you know, stuff like that. I'm not even sure it's years, but uh, this is just a demo. And as you can see, well, this is a free product. The three quarter sleeve kimono dress I have my product that was in the cart which is 348 and the cart total is 348 I could continue shopping this will close the pop-up and this pop-up will be displayed only once uh, per, per uh, session per user in order not to be uh, intrusive and annoying but if the user click on checkout it will bring him or her to the checkout page with the free product, the free gift added in the cart. Like you can see here, this is a special promotion, this is free, this is the subtotal, and voila.